So multi-model, I think, is, a, is, is kind of a uh, misnomer. I mean, there's a lot of people out there that when you try to tell them what multi-model is, they, what, what they tend to do is start describing a polyglot persistence situation where it's like, oh, well, you can do the same thing. You can, have your, you can, you can store some database in Mongo or something else, and, and then you can, you know, for your documents, and then you can use Neo4j for your graphs, and then you can use, well, when you've got everything split out into multiple databases, that's not multi-model. You, you have modeled your data in multiple ways. Um, but what multi-model does for you is it puts it all into one database. You are able to, to persist your data in the way that you want it. You can then transform it to the degree that makes sense for performance and for what you're trying to accomplish. But then you can query it not only like as a graph or as a document or as relational SQL views, but you can do you can mix and match those in the same query. So if you have a complex query um, where you really want, where, where you know maybe it maybe to pare down your search across your millions of records, it makes sense to start with uh, it with a Sparkle query. You you can pare it down with a Sparkle query right away, and then you can go deeper than by by adding in some CTS against you know the actual documents to be able to refine that even further. So you can't do that when you're talking about it was certainly not as easily when you're talking about a polyglot system with lots of data all over the place uh, duplicated and then you've got to make sure that well when we brought it in from this system did we duplicate it over to that system this way when you bring it into mark logic everything's there it's all in your documents and then you can then use an envelope method things like that you're able to then you know have the information where you need it where you can find it and so it, it, it while it doesn't it, while it seems like it's overly complicated, it's really not. It's, a, it's much more simplified because your data just stays where you need it. You're changing how you're looking at it instead.